We don't run it, pull up new to me so I've been thinking about doing like random questions right and I thought I'd put a little twist on it so in here is my bag and I took all my stuff out so and in this bag is a whole bunch of random questions and it's all folded up and it's all random how's 2019 going for you so far it's cool you know it just I'm still getting used to it. We only like, what, four months in? It's actually going slower than I thought. It's a process because I'm trying to get some things happening. I'm trying to stay positive about it, you know? Next one. What's the weirdest compliment you ever got? I feel like the weirdest compliment I got is about my feet. Like ever since I can remember, people are like you got some nice feet. Like if I wear like sandals or something, and I'm just like, thank you. What part of a kids movie completely scarred you? I didn't really watch kid movies like that growing up, but if I did, I would say Matilda. Yeah, I'm gonna say Matilda because the trench pool. She was just so. She's ew. I don't even want to think about her. People like for what? I don't know why. Like each scene she was in, she just scared me. I don't know. I what are some fun, interesting other ways besides war that countries could settle their differences with? Instead of fighting and killing, like what's the point of killing? I don't I don't, I don't just don't understand. That should be illegal. Why isn't that illegal? I need answers, but anyways, I would say dancing, like other parts of countries dancing, like the DJ or whatever, because I imagine a DJ being there, like, it'd be like break dance, like two opponents, like break dancing, and another country say like dance battle. Favorite subject in school? My favorite subject in school was either art. I loved art class like I had to have one each year but it was either art dance class that was cool and social studies I always loved social studies even in elementary school I'm not a school person never was but social studies was my that was my niche how do you feel about polygamy relationships and marriages hey see what the problem is like a lot of people gonna be like uh that's wrong blah 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 but I don't care like you know you really interested in what a household with two wives and one husband two husbands and one wife you know you want to see what type of uh, household that is y'all know y'all want to see especially with um who got two wives D. Ray Davis, y'all know y'all want to be in his household for a day. Like y'all, I just, I have no room to judge. Like I can't shame nobody. Let people do what they want to do. Like if they want to have two husbands or two wives or whatever, let's let the people live. Okay, y'all know y'all want to see in their households like how it's run. I mean, anyway, next question: skin routine. My skin routine. Um, it always changes for the seasons, to be honest. Like, in the wintertime, I use Burt's Bees. Like, I don't know. They just... That's my winter routine. Burt's Bees, cleansing, or masks, or whatever. And then... Fall time, I forgot what I was using, but it was something new. And then... And now, for, like, the spring and the summertime, I'm using Noxzema cleansing cream top notch and then you always want to use some type of oil or witch hazel so for the toner so yeah 
That's what your girl uses. Strangers gift you ever receive. When I was in first grade, I got a bra. I got a bra from my Aunt Panky, and I didn't even have nothing yet. And it was red. Like, it was for, like, it's, like, for now. But it was a red, lacy type of bra. I don't even need this. Would you rather have a horrible short-term memory or a horrible long-term memory? Obviously, y'all don't know who I am. I forget everything. I'd rather have the short. Let's see, let's see this. Oh, I ripped the thing. Uh, wake up as a new random person every year with control of them for a whole year. Or once a week, spend day in a stranger's body without any control. Hmm. I'd rather wake up as a new random person every year. With control of them. What? Wait, that's one person? You gotta be one person for a whole year? I don't know about that. Or spend a whole week. Or spend once a week as a new person without control. Y'all always wanted to be Katie Switcheroo. So I'm gonna say once a week. Cause I don't want to be nobody else for like a whole year. Something that is really popular now but will be embarrassing in five years. What's popular now? I feel like that little floss dance, y'all know. I feel like that's gonna be embarrassing. I feel like our outfit choices are gonna, no we pretty, no. I feel like half of Fashion Nova stuff, we gonna be looking like, what did we want that for? Or that's not even cute. What's one of your fave qualities about yourself? that I'm non-judgmental for the most part because there really be some people out here just shaming <laughs> out of people and it's like what is you not human too like I don't get it I can't shame nobody for the life of me like say because that's I get that from my mother because she taught me young don't be judging nobody because you don't know how somebody else situation is if you lived in their shoes don't do it so that's what she always taught me like, if you a freak i'm gonna just be like go ahead and do you you feel me i live vicariously through people so that's yeah if you a freak go ahead and be a freak because i guarantee you the people shaming you want to be freaks too anyways dang i only got two more questions of me i should have made more What's the sexiest and the least sexiest name? Mature or unique names that you ain't never really heard of. I don't know, like like Greek type of names. Those are cute or like y'all know how we got like the black leaders in the past, how they got them type of names. I think those are kind of kind of sexy. The least sexy names. Probably Bartholomew or or a Petunia. Who names their child Petunia? What's the least sexy name to y'all and what's the sexy name to y'all? Last question, y'all. What is something you don't like about yourself? Like what's a bad habit? Um I feel like I'm too, I always get that I'm too, uh, what's the word, nonchalant. I get that a lot. I'm too nonchalant, but it's like, if I grew up around that, how am I get out of it? I look like my mama, but I'm my father's daughter. I really am, but he ain't give up. That's what I grew up around. That's why people keep telling me I'm a dude because dudes don't care and neither do I. So maybe that's why. But yeah, I feel like I should be more caring because I don't be caring on though too much and that's not good. So I care, but it's like if you show me I shouldn't care, that's going to make me just be more, you know, cool from a distance. So yeah, y'all, that's been my 
my little experiment. I might do that again because it was fun. Y'all should try. Um, I think what's next is uh, what's in my bag, I think. And more reaction videos. I'm trying to get back on that. But yeah, y'all. Like, comment, and hug that red button for me. Yeah. I can tell from your vibe that you're begging me to get in your